Hey, what is that, guys? It is me, Talk of Miner, and today I'm on here. I'm on Roblox here, here to show you guys some of the Sonic fan games found on Roblox. Now, this first one is known as the Forces Project, so let's actually just go full screen real quick. Full screen on. Okay, so that should do it. Um, so yeah, this is the Forces Project. Um, now, I hope this project gets finished because from what I've played, it looks very promising. Um, I mean, the level layout looks kind of meh, but the gameplay itself is pretty dang good. And believe it or not, this fan game is less linear than the actual Sonic Forces game, which is just ridiculous. So, let's go ahead and head into green hill zone um i'm not sure if i'm gonna get copyright for this music because sega actually encourages their fans to make stuff but i'm not sure if i would get copyright from that or not so here's the sonic model real quick so here he is so let's quickly speed run this level. i mean look at this we're already getting more turns and stuff than we did in sonic forces itself which is just both ironic and hilarious at the same time you see i already screwed that up see <laughs> Now that's a bit of a problem I have uh, with this is that it is kind of hard to turn because of the awkward camera controls. Um, it, and if I am playing um, a 3D game um, on the computer, I do prefer to have camera controls. Um, but you know, in this case, not so much. But let's just keep going here. So then you take this path here. And so the springs will, like, I ran into this glitch where the springs wouldn't function. Like, they would just choose when they wanted to function. So it's weird. Also, the double jump is, like, way better than it is in Sonic Forces. Like, look at this. Watch this. Watch. You see, because, um, like, it's not, it's, like, even more powerful than the one in Sonic Colors. Because it's, like, a double jump is, like, a full jump just like in mid-air basically it's ridiculous so then you land down here going oh that was close and just keep running down here Whee! and then if you run into this just give it a second it will take you back to the screen so that is literally all of the forces project so far it looks promising and i hope they do continue the project um you know i really hope they do but yeah anyways let's turn full screen off and head to the next game all right so this next game i want to show you guys is one kind of similar to the one we just played except in my opinion it needs just a bit more of polish I'm not sure if this is just a demo or if it's complete yet, but I hope it's not complete because I do think it needs a bit more of polish. So we're not going to skip this because this is warning some things might not look right. And it can actually cause uh, the game to look kind of blurry, so yeah. Also, I don't know what this music is, so I don't know if I'm going to get copyright for it. But what I do know is that it is really annoying. So, I think this is the level I'm on, which is the double jump level. So let's head into it. Huh. What the? Uh, that was weird. So I've not actually ever played this level before. Um, so I do think the game needs a, just a slight bit more polish. Um, because first off, this is not level design. Um, like, I have to say this, like, while it does at least have curving and stuff, even Sonic Forces level design is better than this. Um, because if you look at this right now, it is, this is not even really platforming, this is more of just, um, just kind of running to your destination, and that's about it. And anytime I have died on this, it's because, um, the platforms blended in too well with their surroundings, and then I end up falling off the edge, and that was in, like, a, a lava-themed level, I think, so, yeah. Also, I'm not really sure where the heck I'm supposed to be going, because it almost seems like I'm going in a circle. So yeah, like I said, this game definitely needs a bit more polish, so I really do hope it's not complete. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did go in a circle, actually. So, because the direction in this game is also pretty dang misleading. Like, 
you don't even know where you're supposed to go. Are you supposed to turn here? Or... Oh, do you see? I died. Try again. See, this game just confuses me. I'm... See, I start here, so I assume I'm supposed to go this way. That's what I'm assuming. But the last time I went this way, I couldn't find anything... Are these platforms I'm supposed to be using? Because if it is, I'll be surprised. Alright, hold on. Alright, so this guy's with me. So yeah, oh jeez, I messed that up. So yeah, this is also multiplayer. So I highly... If this is platforming, that's going to be ridiculous because it was so, like, unobvious. Oh, it was a platform. Warning. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, jeez. That threw me off. That wasn't my fault. I guarantee you that. Okay, so at least I know where to go this time. So at least there's that much. All right, so set up here. It says the double jump level, and so far you've earned stuff. Um, crap, I messed up again. So far, through the levels, you're earned stuff at the end, so I'm assuming at the end of this level, I'm gonna earn the double jump. But it would be nice to have it now, so I didn't have to boost and jump. Um, alright. So let's just kind of take it slow on this part for a second. Alright, let's not screw this up. Alright, so turn. There we go. Oh my! Okay, that was... What the? Oh my gosh, my game. Okay, my game just lagged tremendously when I collided with him. When spawning, I'm not really sure why that happened. That was weird. And not only that, look at the bumps in these in these models. They're just kind of appearing and disappearing um, just whenever they feel like it, which is kind of annoying. Oh my! Yo, for real? I promise we are gonna get to the next the next fan game but i want to i at least want to beat one level on here um before i head to, into the next game now this is ridiculous okay slow down here see look at that it's just disappearing and reappearing whenever it feels like it that's kind of annoying like i said before right. so let's not screw this up Okay. Jeez, what was that loud noise? Is that that thing? Holy crap, it needs to shut up. I'm not gonna lie, though. It is kind of ominous. Oh, jeez. That was a spring. Oh, that threw me off. Come on, man. You can't do that. Ah, oh, dang it. Do I seriously not get a checkpoint for that? I don't. That's ridiculous. That is utterly ridiculous. That is dumb. That is stupid. I'm using some. Right force today. So I tried a Roblox test stream today. Unfortunately, it did not go well at all. Like, just recording works fine, but for some reason when I try to stream with OBS, it does just not want to work for me. Oh jeez, that was really close. The reason I'm going so slow on these platforms is because I'm scared something else is gonna happen. Alright, come on. Can I make it to that spring? You see that's a problem you can't just have the spring in mid-air like that like i don't think there's been a single sonic game where the springs are floating and even if they were those sections were automated um after hitting a different spring that wasn't floating in the air so like i think sonic colors did that at some point because i actually played that today before i recorded this video um Oh, and because of that, I feel like I should be able to tell you guys how close this feels to an actual Sonic game. As far as gameplay goes, as far as it feels, it feels pretty much like a Sonic game. Like a modern Sonic game. I cannot... Come on. Okay. So, that is to air dash, but can you jump and do it? Yeah, but that's what I did. Or can you not air dash once you hit a spring? That would be really weird and awkward, not gonna lie. Come on. What am I doing? See, the slippery controls almost screwed me over. And they did anyways, okay. This is ticking me off, I just wanna get to the next game. All right, we're gonna do it this time. I, I can feel it, we're gonna, we're gonna do it this time. No screw ups, no more screw ups. We're gonna do it this time. There we go, we sped through that part quicker than we ever have. 
Alright, so you want to jump here. So that time we jumped over the spring. Alright. I air dash. I'm going to call the games. I'm going to call that the game stall. Because that... It doesn't look like I can make that jump. Like, it says the double jump level. Yeah, I feel like a lot of this platforming has to do with double jumping. And why are Sonic's feet glowing? Like, I don't think they were like that when I first played this game. It's maybe because of certain power-up I got. I don't know. Oh, jeez. Okay. Oh, jeez. So, like I said before, this game definitely needs a bit more polish. Um, before I feel like it can be a complete... I jumped. Alright, guys. We're gonna do it two more attempts. If I can't get it on the first... Uh, on these next two attempts, I will just give up and move on to the next game. That one did not count, though. I, I did not need to do that. So, still two more attempts. Alright, we're gonna do this. The only thing that... That also did not count. That was a glitch. This is ridiculous. Dude, that spawned and it killed me again. Okay. Dude, whenever you collide with another um, player in this game, it, like, lags tremendously. Why does it do that? No, I am not being your friend. You just keep... You just made my game lag multiple occasions on multiple occasions. I am not being your friend. Endearing a recording too, man. It hurts. All right. I screwed that up. Uh, okay, last attempt. If I can't get this attempt, we'll move on to the next game. Even though I would like to do more than one attempt. I just I just need to move on to the next game. I didn't think I'd be spending this much time here. Given how easy the past levels were, this should not be this hard. And I feel like it's not even hard for the right reason. Like, it's one of those games that's not hard for the right reason. It's hard because it's being unfair. I didn't die. That, I did not fall there. Okay, I will also not count that as an actual death because that was the game's fault. I touched that platform that was left there. Like, I'm sure that chunk of platform wasn't meant to be left there. It probably accidentally got left there um, during level design. Um, but I'm still calling that the game's fault. Like, it was not my fault. Because I touched it. And whether or not it was supposed to be left there, I took it to my advantage, and then it kills me for it. Is that a good or a bad thing that it killed me for taking that to my advantage? I'm done. We're, we're just gonna... We're just gonna move on to the next game now. Moving on to the next game. See you guys there. Alright guys, so this next one is known as Sonic Genesis Engine problem with this game level design is almost like non just not complete whatsoever i suppose we don't even really need it in full screen this time since it's just this like little black thing it's just a little screen and all this blackness but you know whatever so we're going to head to all right so if we actually go let's just go to green hill zone act three let's just do it anyway but if you listen huh that's weird. In Green Hill Zone Act 3, it doesn't look or play like Green Hill Zone. It's more like the past version of Palm Tree Panic. That's weird. Alright, so, as you can see, this is very unfinished. And what's weird is, I think this game used to be way different. Either that or the person who I watched play that game just led me to the wrong game. Because there is no way this is the same game. It is very unfinished. The sprites, a lot of the sprites are just grids. Like, the flower sprites are just grids. The level design feels incredibly incomplete. Like, look at this. That is not finished level design right there. I mean, the game lags quite a bit, but I don't even care because this is this is a remake on Roblox. I really don't care if it lags. Main problem is this level design is not complete. And that's probably why they gave you the option to use debug mode straight from the get-go is because they knew it wasn't complete. And that just kind of angers me, too. And look at that. It's in the ground. It's in the ground, you guys. Like, just take me back to the level slots already. And if we go to Mystic Cave, look at this, guys. Look at this. This is ridiculous. The background's missing. 
that's just ridiculous and i uh, see and look you can fall through the floor there and look you there's no way to get up there without using debug mode like the debug mode is supposed to be like a bonus isn't it like the debug mode is not supposed to be something that's necessary to get through up like this is not complete at all this is ridiculous and then look if we go to what are the different special states represent i think they I haven't- I've tried 1 and 4, but I'm not sure what 2 or 3 does. I think they're all just blue sphere stages. Which you actually- are actually total crap to control. Because everything just keeps disappearing. This is ridiculous. Alright, let's try- what is SS Debug? What is going on? Please take me back to the level side. What is this continue button? I've never actually pressed it. You have died better and alone. Retry. Can I press no? So I can't press no. Oh, the continue, like the continue screen from... So yeah, yeah as you can see, this game is incredibly unfinished. So I'm not going to waste too much time here. We're just going to... We're just gonna exit full screen now, and we're gonna head straight into the next game. Alright, there we go. This one is known as Sonic Simulator. Now, if we, as soon as you start up the game, it says, Welcome to Sonic Simulator. This is meant to be a humorous game, not a good one, so don't take it too seriously. Tweet pictures using hashtag Sonic Simulator Roblox, and I may retweet them. So there you go. Um, so yes, this game is kind of meant to be a joke game, but at the same time, it's actually kind of a good game. So... Oh, Sonic, <laughs> Sonic has no pupils, so the game is currently loading in for me, why was there an air horn that scared me so bad, so the game's slowly loading in for me, like look at this, Look how slow this game is loading for me. Alright, so yeah, stuff has finally started to get in. But we can already go ahead and use the walk speed, I guess. So this is walk speed 50. Makes you go fast, obviously. There's actually some Sonic-related things around here. You can even collect rings. Go past um, posts and whatnot. There we go. So stuff is finally loading in. Sonic finally has people's. And so now we just press hat remover, and then we can become Sonic. Yay. Oh, but we need our walk speed back. Okay, there we go. So this is also like a Sonic, like holiday themed Sonic one. But I'm not going to use that one right now. Oh, jeez. Well, I, I just realized that was there. Uh, I didn't know the sides of it would hurt you. What is this, Sonic Cross World? Alright, so yeah, let's actually get the hat remover and more first before we get the walk speed, because it gets rid of your walk speed when you turn on a more for some reason. But yeah, this is the holiday update, and believe it or not, this game is actually somewhat fun to just mess around and roleplay in. It's actually pretty dang well made, too. There's even some nice little Sonic references, like this Death Egg robot. You can also use these springs, actually, like you can actually use them. They're actually functional. Isn't that amazing? Now... I believe there is a way to get to that top of the building. Yep. Like, there's another way to get to the top, too, but, like, this is the quicker way. You can use springs. Also, I think Rouge is down here on one of these. Never mind. I, th I, I thought for sure Rouge was one on. Unless she's up there. Have I ever made it all the way up there? Oh, well, I guess we're not going to find out because that spring just failed on me. Come on. Right, keep going. Oh my gosh. It keeps making the ring sound. No. I. Okay, so the rings somewhat function, but not all the way. So that's interesting. That is beauty at its finest. So can we use the spring to actually like just get up here? Yeah, but, you know. Alright, this is, this is ridiculous. Alright, I'm, screw it, I'm done. Uh, wait, what, what did that say? Why did I step on it? 
I don't know what that was. Um, we also have things like Chili Dogs, which doesn't want to load in. We have things like Hoverboard. Air Horn, that doesn't want to work. All this stuff just goes away whenever I try to use it. Okay, whatever. The Supersonic Raceway is this way. Um, but, uh, you know, I think it's under construction? Unless it means this thing. Is that what it means? Uh, no, it is, it doesn't take you anywhere. <laughs> what the? Oh, uh, I didn't want to come here. No, it didn't tell me that it would bring me here. Oh my goodness. Oops. Take me back. Take me back. Okay, I'll be right back, guys. Alright, you guys. I'm extremely sorry about that. I had no idea that would take me to a different game. So, once again, let's get our hat remover. Get the morph and get the walk speed times 50. And there we go. So, yeah. Um, what was I even doing before? Yeah, I was gonna go to the supposed supersonic raceway, but like I said, it was under- I think it was under construction and whatnot. What's this? Oh, invincibility? Is that what it gave me? Because it doesn't seem to be working. Oh, now it's working. Okay, that's weird. Um, what is this? Regen. I think that's for, like, health or something. There's also a motor bug here. Can you actually kill it? No, I don't think you can. What if we try and... Ooh, yes. Me want... And my hand is still sticking out. Oh, no! I don't know why my hand is now forever sticking out. That's weird. And my game is lagging. Nothing is working. No, Just kill me. No, no! Well, that that worked out just just fine. Just fine. You know, we're actually going to get our hat remover. And we're going to quickly run over to here. To get the holiday Sonic. Yay. And surprisingly, you don't have to pay Robux for it. Although it does look kind of unfinished. Well, now I don't like it. So I'm just going to kill myself now. What the... Okay, well, let's just reset that. Uh, why is my head all the way over here? Okay, so, yeah, that actually, that model, I never realized how unfinished that was with the walking animation. Actually, this walking animation is kind of unfinished, too. So that one was, like, pretty much no different. Oh, forget it. Happy Holidays. To celebrate the Christmas season, we're making the VIP fruit room free and accessible to everyone for a limited time. Don't wait. Give it a shot today. Is it the VIP room? Give me a second, dude. I have never seen these. Pink, Pink Sonic female alternative, um, or, or, original the character do not steal, um, original Sonic character do not steal. I didn't even see that, and, and and it said that anyways. Okay, that that is hilarious. Um, let's head back here. So is this a VIP room? Oh, wow, these guys are really nice. They actually made it free. What is that screaming? Okay, Neon Sonic. Ooh, was it like? Sonic Adventure DX? Sonic Sonic CD. That does not look like Sonic from Sonic CD. That is Sonic Adventure Sonic. Classic Sonic recolor. He looks a bit too tall. Maybe Sonic and all this. This looks sweet! I like. Can I actually turn into one? Or is it like, because I have a different morph on? Okay, well I guess I gotta go. I guess I just gotta die. Oh. And then I'll just get my walk speed back, and then I'll go to the VIP room and whatnot and get my Sonic Adventure morph, even though that's not what it says it is. I'll believe it anyways, because that's exactly what it is. Maybe just a typo or something. Why is there a skeleton in this game? Okay. VIP room would not load for a second. Uh... Dude, I don't think that gave me a Sonic Morph. I think that just took away my face. Walk speed 65. Oh! So the VIP room even has faster walk speed. Okay, better idea. Let's just reset real quick once again. I know I'm resetting a lot and I'm not really showing around this game. But just real quick, this is going to be the last thing I do before I show around the game more. Let's just get our hat remover. Let's just get Sonic. And let's go get our walk speed 65 so I can also show you guys around quicker. As soon as this VIP room wants to load. Oh, jeez. Did it load me in? No, it didn't. 
Okay, does the VIP room just straight up not want to work for me? It won't let me in the VIP room. Want special Sonic, more like classic Sonic, Tails, or Super Sonic? Touch this door to buy VIP pass. No, thank you. It's free today. Except it's not working. Finally, jeez Louise. All right, so let's get our walk speed of 65. Woo, I feel so fat. What? I just want to do a video, and my game just completely... What the heck? Guys, my game, what happened? Guys, I don't know what's going on. Oh, okay, that scared me. I thought my computer just straight up crashed. Okay, so let's... I guess the squawk speed just, like, made it freeze for some reason. So, yeah, here it is. So, you're around. There's a motobug that doesn't move for some reason. The update board, blah, blah, blah. There's a cake up here. I, I like cake. Can I have cake? Can I, can I have the cake, please? I love cake. Yay. Okay, so over here, there's a tiny snowman. He's so cute. Okay, and over here, there is some memes. They are very high quality memes. Some bank memes right there. The reason for our for the season our lord and savior jesus christ yeah that's right yeah that's right he is i think that's the super sonic race way i don't freaking know i don't know what's going on anymore oh wait oh, wait ever wanted to race your friends as custom sonic character well now you can meet up with your friends and go to and go for the win or purchase vip server on the da, da, da. okay oh wow it's actually not un not unfinished or Oh, just kidding. Yes, it is. Coming soon. Hello, can I talk to you about this? Hey there, bud. Sorry, but the Supersonic Raceway isn't done yet. Come back later. Fine. Well, I was just gonna, like, go away on my, on my hoverboard, but it didn't want to work for me for some reason. So, that's unfortunate. Also, Eggman Challenge is under construction. That's unfortunate. This is also the scrapyard. I've visited this place before. The scrapyard is a place where removed assets are kept. These things were originally going to appear in the main sections of the game, but were scrapped, most likely due to performance or scripting issues. Even this info board is an old prototype, and it shows how the boards would have originally looked. I mean, they kind of look the same to me, other than the gray color. So yeah, this place is just full of scrap things. Like, most of the things here don't work. So I wouldn't recommend using any of it. Can I collect this red ring? No, I guess that's a part of the performance issues. There's also this thing that I guess it would have been originally able to fly. It would have been awesome, dude. Man, he should really re rework that into the game. So you got that over there. And what is that? Oh, is it Santa? Is it Santa coming down the chimney? Let's go see Santa. Santa is coming down the chimney. And he's stuck. Well, he deserves it. I don't really know why he deserves it, but let's just say he does. Coming soon. What's coming soon? Creator only. Well, what happens no, if I try to go? No, no! Well, I, I, I guess. I guess. I guess that's a fair punishment. Anyways, guys. So there's also a music option, but I, I like the music, so I'm gonna keep it on. But anyways, guys, that is it for this video. That was Sonic Fan Games in Roblox. I meant to keep this video fairly long um, because I want to make up for my videos have been kind of really short recently and I wanted to make up for that and so um, yeah so that is pretty much going to be it for this video if you guys did enjoy please leave a like uh, and comment down below and I will uh, see you guys next time um, hold on okay peace